Princess Kate is keen to improve her visibility on engagements and outings and has noticeably been wowing royal watchers recently with her bold color choices. For the South Korean state visit on Tuesday Kate stepped out in a striking Catherine Walker red coat dress and matching hat. While at the Shaping Us National Symposium her purple Amelia Wickstead trouser suit said almost as much as her keynote speech. Royal commentator Sarah Vine believes the princess is now following in the footsteps of the late Queen Elizabeth, who also used colour to stand out and draw attention to herself when out in public. She said, this was a classic tactic that the Queen had. She knew she was quite a small person in a sea of people, so the best way to get noticed was to just wear the same colour from top to toe. You are either an orange person or a purple person or a green person and everyone can see you. She was very visible and now Catherine has done that. Click here to join our WhatsApp community to be the first to receive news about the royal family referring to the Amelia Wickstead suit. Ms. Vine told Palace Confidential. It was Quality Street Purple. That's what it call it. Wearing block colors was something Her Late Majesty did frequently. As her fashion mantra stated, I must be seen to be believed. Words that appear to be rubbing off on Kate. Silk Fred's head stylist, Megan Watkins, explained the Queen's three key rules when it came to dressing, and the first rule was always color blocking for impact. The Cullen Express Premium member support fearless journalism read the Daily Express online. Advert free get super fast page loading start 30 day free trial, she explained. The queen would usually opt for one bright color and ensure her whole look centralized around this, often preferring a structured jacket and skirt combination in a matching shade with a complementary shoe. It is fair to say that the queen paved the way for color blocking, inspiring many of us to try the style ourselves. Step 2 of her look was structured silhouettes. As Ms. Watkins described the Royals' classic ensemble as a wide-brimmed hat, structured shoulder coat or jacket, mid-length skirt, black boxy handbag and black low-heeled shoes. The style expert added, This sharp silhouette is something we also see frequently from the Princess of Wales, who is often seen sporting dresses that have a tailored and elegant structure to them. The third rule of dressing like the Queen is to remember the importance of accessories, as the monarch was rarely seen without her three-strand pearl necklace or black handbag. Brooches were another outfit enhancer she enjoyed wearing, with royal jewellery often being passed down through generations of women and being worn again and again over the span of decades.